So now you just perverted what belonged to God. God said, bring your tithes and offerings. Remember, I told you a few weeks ago, it didn't say singular. It said plural. Tithes and offerings. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bring your tithes and offering into the storehouse. Yes, yes. Not your house. Right. It's not the same old story. But, but, but Pastor, we ain't got groceries. Well, if you pay, if you understood the principle of tithe. Right, 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 right. Jesus. right. If you understood the principle of tithe, you will understand. He said, he shall provide or he shall supply all of my needs, not my wants, all my needs according to his riches and glory. Come on here. So, Let's make it very clear. If you take care of his business, he will take care of your business. Right, right, right. 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 Yes, he will. I'm a witness. But, but you got to understand the principle. I tell, I tell people all the time, you can't get mad at God because you don't do the principle right. Right. The right. principle works. Right. You just got to learn how to work it. Uh -huh. Well, what's the principle, overseer? Seek ye first uh -huh. the kingdom. Yeah. Do God's work. Uh -huh. Everything you need will be added. That's, that's, that's true. true. My, my. That's true. That's the principle. It did not say seek your husband or your wife. Mm -hmm. It says seek the kingdom first. Kingdom. But remember, I taught you last week that he said, bring the tenth. Bring, bring in the tenth. If, and this is what bothers me. If God can do more with 10% mm -hmm. than you can do with your 90, Amen. I, I don't get why it's such a big deal, Mother, that folks, they, they want to blame God thinking that that little 10% that they give mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's going to make or break who you are. Yes. Yes. Say it. That's right. That's right. Say it. You, you, yes, you're giving. I understand. God bless you and everything that you do. But your 10% is not going to make a dent in the 90 that God has allowed you. Not that you right. should have, right. but God has allowed you to right. operate That's with. Right. That's right. Right. And like I told you, if you if it's that big of a deal that your ten percent is gonna make or break you, keep your money. Keep it. I know. Keep it. Because watch, all you're doing is allowing your ten percent to pervert the rest of the offering. All right. Because you're giving it in the wrong spirit. And unfortunately, I can't allow your perverted gift. To mess up the anointing and the giving in this house right. because you got an attitude because of your 10%. Right. Yes. Yes. Just cut it straight. Just cut it straight. You want to have a little nasty attitude because it's your week to pay tithes. <laughs> Come on. Get over yourself. Let me give you a story. I used to get mad a lot. First lady can tell you. Every time pay, pay, pay we came, I was mad because I knew I had to pay bills. And I'm like, I work too hard to have to keep on giving up my money every two weeks to pay bills. I sh there should be a law that allows me to hold on to my money when I want to hold on to my money. Now listen, I didn't say I got mad because of time. I said I got mad because of bills. Don't sit here and lie on me. I said I got mad because of bills. There's a difference. Ties, I have a, it, ties didn't bother me. Ties is wonderful. I love it. That's something I'll give God any day. Now, Bill. 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 Santander. <laughs> Sally Bay. Sally Bay, SRP. Yeah. 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 Fries, Walmarts. All of, All of that stuff. Now, hold on. I got an attitude right now. Right? Because I don't think I should always give you your money. You ain't work for it, I did. Oh, I know that's hard. Oh, hard. You don't know what I went through to get this. Real attitude. I, I'm just telling y'all how I got to live. It's just me. I can't tell you about nobody else but myself. But I had to understand, because watch. 
Sister Albert, Mr. Albert, I had to understand I had to pay the people uh -huh. if I wanted to keep what I had. Right, right, right. 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 That's the right. bad part. That's that's really it. So, I be getting what? <laughs> yes, God. What I don't get from people is you will pay the utility bill, uh -huh. you will pay your car note, yeah, yeah. you will pay everybody else, but you won't give God the money that belongs to him so you can continue to pay these people to live right. the way that you want to live. My God. Say that. Say you that. want to get an attitude yeah. with God because he requires a small portion of what you get. And everybody else won't have your check. But right. everybody else wants right. your whole the check. Whole right. 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 They don't want to and deposit. Because if you think about it, you don't make that much money. You right. You right. And because you don't make that much money, one bill probably can clean you out. Yes. You better know it. I know that's right. right. Yes. Let's take it. So you, you, you want to get mad at God because that one bill cleaned you out and you felt that your $150 that you still, uh, that, that you gave to God would do you more better than probably the eight or 900 that you had to spend on bills. And God looks at you and tells you, how, are, how, how does that add up? Right. Okay. That this 150 will do more for you than the eight or nine that you just gave away to these other people. Uh, but then most of the stuff that we pay bills for is not a necessity. Mm. Oh, I ain't gonna get no likes on that. Bro, hit it. it. Um, hit it. it. Hit it. It's all right. Hit Let's it. go ahead and be real. Like. Like. Let's go ahead and be real. Set. A lot of this foolishness that we paying all of this money for, we don't really need it. You ain't even at home that much to Man, watch TV. You right. You paying four or five hundred dollars to Cox. For yeah. well, what? For what? For what? I need to know. All you do is sit on your phone. You sit on, what is it? What they call it? Netflix? Uh, and you paying four or five hundred dollars for cable service. You don't use pop for Netflix. So you, I'm, I'm just trying to, baby, I'm trying to that's ten dollars a month because because we want to get mad at God or we want to get and this is this is what what bothers me and let me help deliver some of y'all stop trying to act like the men and women of God is using your tithe to make their lives a little yes. better. Yes. Don't worry about it. Well, he Ooh, dragged around, he dragged around in a better yeah. car than we are. Well, maybe he had it before he met you. Never you never know. You never know. But but hold on. Let me let me come with some of these crooked pastors out here. Some of y'all Negroes are taking God's people's money. Yeah, I said it. If you want to come for me, come for me. Right, 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 right. That's true. That is true. Don't come. And let me tell you, as a prophet in the Lord's church, you taking God's people's money, God is going to find you for what it is you've done. Right, right, right. Yeah. You want, to, you want to get mad at God's people because they stop giving, well, stop perverting their gift and maybe they'll be yeah, free to right, give right, more. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. Yes. Uh-huh. He said it right there. Yep. You can't pervert the gift and expect God to bless it. It don't work that way. Well, my church ain't growing. Well, think about what you're doing with the gifts that you're supposed to be given. Right. Mm -hmm. The gifts that's supposed to be offered up to God. Remember, I told you on last week that the leaders, the, that the Levites, they put the box, the offering box on the outside of the temple yeah. so that they can be seen giving time. Yeah. Who's the last time you seen your leader actually give a tithe? Mm -hmm. Or are they sitting in the corner trying to be deep like they hearing from God? <laughs> Every offering time you can speak in a tongue. <laughs> Shut your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and, and tell them we over here 8920 North 23rd Avenue you want to come see me come see me you cannot pervert God's gifts and expect the house to be blessed That's right. right it just doesn't work that way no it doesn't right you have you have to be a good steward of what God yes is doing that's very true. 
You got to be a good steward of what God is giving to the house. The money that God, and, and when people tithe and when people give offering, they don't give it to the pastor. They give it for the upbuilding of the kingdom right, of God. Right, right. So if, if, if you got 50 million building funds <laughs> and ain't nothing being built, there's a problem. A big one. <laughs> There's no doorknob that's been put on the church. Nobody's seen a new coat of paint anywhere. But we want to give. We want to be mad because we need to give more money in the building fund. Take the little poster down, sit yourself down somewhere, and go and pray and ask God how to do it all over again. Do it over, God.